beautiful friends welcome back to my channel so I am in Malawi it's so exciting I have not been back to Malawi in about 12 years the last time I was here I was crossing Africa from South Africa to Egypt by myself carrying a portable massage table so it's definitely been a while I'm so excited to be back it's like being here for the first time because even coming in last night I noticed there's so many changes that have happened so much more infrastructure so I'm heading out to the big city lights of Lulongwe today and I'm just gonna check it out and just see if I even recognize it because I probably won't even recognize it. It's been that long. That is Shay. Hi guys. How are you doing? I'm good and how are you? I'm good, thanks. Nice to have you here. Well, I'm happy to be here. Thank after you. We weren't sure that I was coming. Oh yeah, <laughs> I actually lost hope, yes. yes. Because of the communication and everything. Yeah. Oh my God, but I really wanted to. Ah, let's go check out the long way. I love that when you come out of Sherry's house, instantly there's like corn, a nice big cornfield right there. I love it, you know you're in Africa when your front yard is a cornfield. I totally love it. This is such a cute little complex. It's like it's really cute. It's like a nice little neighborhood complex. Yeah. I love it. Oh, and you can you can also see that it's very safe. It's gated. It's like a gated little community of safety. Yeah, I love it. When you get out from the compound outside, you can get a public transport. Normally, the price is 300, but we're gonna negotiate. It's gonna be 200. Ooh, 200. Watch. Let's see if we can do it, guys. <laughs> Guys, check out this traffic here. There is a lot of traffic. Look like away out in the distance, you can see all the traffic going up the road. And lots of people. It is super busy today. I'm buying a SIM card and I looked through all of these and I chose an Airtel card which was right there. I picked a number that I figured would be easy to memorize. And uh, luckily I carry a photo of my passport so I can get this done. It is so, so interesting. So you see this Nico Center here. The last time I was in Lilongwe, 12 years ago, this was a bus station and I didn't even recognize it. I actually recognized nothing in Lilongwe and I didn't remember this was the bus station until I seen the Standard Bank and then everything came back to me because that Standard Bank was there 12 years ago. This was all, there was some bush, some trees and a bus station. And I remember getting dropped off here. I need to get some kwacha in the middle of this big bus station and the only bank was Standard Bank and it wouldn't work with my card that's a whole nother story I went on a wild goose chase that day which is a story I should tell you guys but not right now but it was just because I seen the Standard Bank that I recognize this area otherwise it looks totally different this Nico Center was not there how long has the Nico Center been here for? it should be less than five years less than five years yeah. so lots of changes have happened everything wow and I remember there was a certain point in time yeah when I got off the bus from this place yeah I had actually low consumer from this no way, Lokoshima! Yeah, yeah. Wow, <laughs> crazy! And now it's a big mall. Yeah. That is so crazy. That's one thing I love is I love coming back to places after not being here for so long and seeing the changes. And when you actually do recognize the place, you're like, whoa, this was that place. It's just crazy how you know, 12 years is a long time. Lots of things change. Yeah. Yeah. But it's all coming back to me now. <laughs> You can see in the corner there, that's Standard Bank. So this used to be all a bus terminal. None of this mall was here. And now there's this huge mall. It's so crazy, it's changed so much. A little bit of local music. This is city center. This is not what I expected city center to look like. It is so new looking. Everything here is brand new, all these buildings. It's really calm. 
Two taxis later, there it goes. It's a local taxi, so people just hop in and then you pay like a portion of what the price is. Um, but yeah, two taxis later, came through the town center and now we're going for our local lunch and I am super, super excited. It's been a year since I came here. I'm really looking forward to have yes. my local food. Yes! Oh, I'm glad that she's coming with me if she hasn't been here in a year. Okay, so look at all of this is actually restaurants, you guys. Every single one of these are restaurants, but most of them are closed today because it's Saturday, so there's very few open. To be honest though, I like coming on a day like this for my first time here. That way there's not tons going on. It's just us. <laughs> just us having the best time. <laughs> So it's kind of nice just to like see it like this and then next time in the long way we'll come during the week so I can see the contrast of when it's like packed with people. She said there's normally loads of people here you said? Yes, a lot of people and the cars are just like everywhere. Really? Yeah. Crazy. Ah. So this is nice to see it like this, like peaceful. And today not a lot of shops are open and you don't have much uh, like selections. Right. So you just go those few places which are open yeah but during the normal day monday to friday i'm telling you you have like different options so wow. you can go anywhere you want wow. you can go check on this uh, shop you don't like it you can go to another one <laughs> that's, that's kind of cool yeah. that we can really pick what you want wow. yeah today we're just going to take what we can get <laughs> There's a so, few choices. Yeah. Actually, I've uh, already seen what I'm gonna eat today. Oh, yes. what is it? Um, I wanna have some yamachoma somewhere. Yamachoma, never heard Did of it. Did you say that? No. Okay. Yamachoma. Let's, Let's do it. You. There's no kitchen. So does that mean every day they have to yeah. bring their kitchen with them? Yeah. And then they bring tables? Yeah, they bring tables too. Wow, they bring tables and a kitchen. Mm -hmm. And then they set up shop. Yeah. Crazy. Some of them do have a few tables in it, but... Yeah, but most of them are actually totally empty. Those ones are like installed. Okay. Yeah, but the, the tables which are like uh, removable, they remove them. Wow. Just to be safe in case. Um, that's a lot of work. You know, setting oh, up yeah. a restaurant, taking a restaurant down every day. Yeah. Setting up a kitchen. Exactly. Wow. That is exactly. hats off. Hats off to the hardworking people that do this. <laughs> what do they have? Because I didn't understand what they were saying they have. So what they have is uh, liver, uh -huh. local chicken, yeah. hybrid chicken. Yeah. Yamachoma, this is Yamachoma. Yamachoma, which is beef? About, yeah, yes. it's beef. Beef, fried okay. beef, yeah. Fried beef. And they have like uh, local vegetables. Mm -hmm. Chisoso. Chisoso. Blenja. Oh, oh yeah, which is that? Blackjack in English? Blackjack? Mm, What's blackjack. that? It's um, pumpkin leaves. Oh, pumpkin. I love pumpkin leaves. They have. Okay. Beans. Beans, okra. Okra. Also love that. <laughs> and they say yeah. we can have as much as Wow, it's all you can eat. So, wow, all right. This is a place. So this is the place. We were going to check other places, but yes. we found the place on the first try. Uh -huh. Sakomo. <laughs> all right, she's heating it up. Mm -hmm. Okay. You're going to try Look it. Look at me. I'm trying one. <laughs> Tell me how it is. Mm, is it good? Soft. Really soft, mm. amazing. I want to try this with some chilies. Oh, chili would be great. Mm -hmm. I love chili. Yep. Ah. Mm. <laughs> Talele? Talele? Talele. Yeah. Talele, okay. Wayne, okay. what's those vegetables mm. again? Is it good? Blackjack. Blackjack? And chichewa is called chisoso. Chisoso, mm -hmm. okay. And then we got goat intestine, mm -hmm. which I've never tried. It'll be interesting. And the shima. Mm -hmm. And then on mine, I got lots of different vegetables. What's this one? This is Chinese. Okay, Chinese. Mm. And this is, oh, this is pumpkin leaves. Yeah, pumpkin leaves. I recognize those. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, two types of shima I got. I got whole grain and white. Very exciting. Mm. Trying everything today. Oh, there goes a goat intestine. Mm. Mm. Oh, you didn't even bite it. Like, mm, you liked it already? Oh, she's happy. Mm. She's very happy. So tasty. Is it? Mm. Nice. <laughs> I'm already a sweaty mess, but which vegetable do you think I should try first? Which one? Which vegetable should I try first? I think we should, because we've already tried this one, right? Yep. We should try this one. This one? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm going to try the whole grain, the whole grain shima with, what do you call this one again? Chisoso. Chisoso, mm -hmm. which is the vegetable like in sauce. Okay. This is what we got, guys. Whole grain shima chisoso. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Tastes like spinach. It's got really good. some um, 
peanut paste as well. Oh, peanut paste, nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's delicious, guys. I've never tried goat intestine before, so it's my first time. And you know what? It looks like an intestine. It does. So I was, I was trying to break a piece off, but the whole thing was unwinding because it's an intestine. So we're gonna, can I dip it in your sauce? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna dip it in a little bit of sauce. And here we go. Hmm. Well, the flavor is nice. It's a bit chewy, but it's not bad. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Pero is it one of your favorite things? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you love it. If I wanna eat something local, mm -hmm. because this thing, for it to get ready when you cook it, it takes a while. Oh, okay. So when I go out, mm -hmm. I wanna eat something local. Yeah. This is my favorite. Nice. Let me show you. Okay, because the minute they said they have it, you're like, okay, I know what I want. Okay, this yeah. This is now the whole piece. Yeah. She showed you, but it, not like the whole piece. And it's a little parcel. Show them how it's and tied together. It's like tied. You see that? Yeah. You see that? Uh, those are the intestines. All tied together. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There you go. She's gonna dip it. Oh, I thought you were gonna eat the whole thing. <laughs> oh gosh, no way. <laughs> it's too big. It's too big. <laughs> you were gonna do it. <laughs> That was so, so good, wasn't it? So cool, I'm full right I now. I am so full. I wish I had a bed somewhere <laughs> yeah, and no. I can lie down for 15 minutes. <laughs> Nap time. Trust me. <laughs> yeah, totally. That was really good. We didn't finish everything because there was way too no much food. Way. But we the food was gave it our so best much. shot. Yeah. And we have taken some home. Did yes. I tell you? We got a little, ah, let me show you. little to-go pack. Little you see this? Yeah. We're going to eat this at home. It's our snack. Tonight. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> She's just taking a little run. <laughs> So this is called the Camus Sodasorium. Camus Sodasorium? Mm. Okay, and what's the history of it? This is uh, the forefounder yeah. of Malawi. Uh -huh. he, uh, Malawi got independence in 1960, 1964. Yeah. So he was our first president. Oh, wow. Yeah, he said in his one of his speech, yeah. he broke the stupid federation. <laughs> Wow. By the way, uh, there's a federation between Zimbabwe, yeah. Malawi, and Zambia. Oh, okay. Zambia was uh, northern Rhodesia, Zimbabwe yeah. was southern Rhodesia, and Malawi was Nyasaland. Wow, he was almost 100 years old. Mm. He was 99. Mm -hmm. Wow, he had a long life. Those are like... Unity uh -huh. and loyalty. Those are like the pillars. Yeah. He believed built Malawi. Oh, unity and loyalty. Uh, there's a, I like there it. Four. So this there's is another one there. We're gonna see. When we go oh, there's up. four. Okay, the four pillars makes yeah. sense. Yeah. I like it. So four pillars. Yeah. Building Malawi. Wow. So they're like uh, now the, the the party which is ruling now. One yeah. of them is uh, for him. Okay. Yeah. This is just um, a model. Yeah. He's not here. Okay. He is. He's. Inside, but his body's embalmed. Yeah, Sherry was telling me that the president's body is actually embalmed, and people can go and see his body. It's not open to the public right now. This is the lion symbol. Yeah, it's uh, one of the symbols he used to have uh, a thing like with a lion on it. Okay. And uh, he used to have, as you can see here, this thing. It was a present. Oh he yeah. From a certain president, a certain country. Really. So he used to carry it anywhere. He Everywhere. Goes. So it was a special present then? Yeah. What a beautiful building though, such a beautiful building. Except for the one crack over there. Why do people have to break glass? I don't know. But the plants and yeah, it's nice, nice building. This is the parliament. Yeah, you can just see from here. Okay, this is the parliament building. It's very beautiful. And Sherry was telling me she's been inside and it's very nice inside. It looks like it would be super nice inside. We're walking through the botanical gardens at the moment and they're super beautiful, very green and lush. And a lot of people come here to pray. So we're passing a lot of people that are here praying. And there's also people here on dates. They're having picnics with their significant other. It's just, it's beautiful.
tell me about the church things because there's a church oh, service going on in the background. Yeah. So mostly mm -hmm. a lot of people come at Botanic Garden to pray. Mm -hmm. So they like they don't meet at their church. Yep. They'll meet at the Botanic Garden. Okay. Mostly to pray for burning issues. Yeah. Which they want God to uh, attend to. Okay. So it's like they are they don't want any disturbance. Yeah. They just dedicate the whole day praying. Wow. Yeah. So the Botanical Gardens is a very spiritual place yeah, in the long way too. Very spiritual. As you can see, all these people you see, <laughs> they are coming here to pray. Of course, uh, during exams, like uh, when the, uh, the students are writing exams, others are studying for their higher education, mm -hmm. they are about to write exams, they come for studies. Yeah. But mostly, all these people are coming to pray. Wow. Yeah. That's amazing. <laughs> and dates, because there's people on their, on and their, dates. yeah. Memorial <laughs> Tower. This is War Memorial Tower. Yeah, we do commemorating the soldiers who died in the First World War. Okay. About 1914 and years 1918. 1914 to 1918. Those years we were under British war. Okay. So the British we just came here to pick the soldiers and deploy in different countries: France, Germany, Italy. Wow. Wherever the First World War we were involved. Wow, so there's a lot of soldiers from Malawi in that oh, war. Yeah, yeah, you just have the British. Okay. We're gonna go up these stairs. All the way up. See in the background there on the wall, guys, that's all the names of the soldiers. Yeah. Honestly, I'm on a high from that incredible experience from being on that high high place. Now I'm on a high. And Sherry was saying, first time ever for her too. First time ever. Like in I'm your really whole liked life. it. Yeah. Isn't it so cool? The, the, the first time I came, yeah. I didn't go up. I was right. told that uh, the place we went is only the soldiers who goes there. Wow. So you can just imagine. And, and this lady here, oh my god, he likes climbing. <laughs> I've noticed. Yeah, I like climbing. <laughs> yeah, I don't mind it actually. <laughs> this is a day uh, God just wanted us to have some fun. It's so true. Yeah. The day just keeps getting better. We didn't even know that it's gonna end like this. No. I'm, I'm telling you. We didn't even know what we planned today. All uh -huh. I told Sherry was that I want to go uh -huh. make a video and share with you guys yeah. the long way and I want to see what it looks uh -huh. like now. Uh -huh. And it turned out to be better than both of us expected. Very. 
Yeah. So oh my good. Gosh. That's why, guys, you got to remember some of the best adventures of your life are the most spontaneous and the ones that you don't plan. Yeah, yeah. True. Definitely. I, yeah, I agree with you. Yeah. <laughs> Look at how much traffic there is. It's rush hour. Everyone's finishing work. That's it. What a day. What a what day. A day. <laughs> Amazing day. Yes, it was like full of adventures. Oh my god. Unexpected adventures. Exactly. We've I seen, I'm still so thinking about how we left home. Yes. With no clue where we're going, what we're gonna do. <laughs> so and here we are with a lot of fun. Yeah, it was so fun. We can't believe the whole day has gone by. Oh and it's been so fun, unexpected and really awesome. Oh yeah. And it's the best of a long way. Oh yeah. <laughs>